Hi friends! Today I painted this look, which was inspired by Cyborg um, from the new Justice League movie. Um, me and my partner just watched the Snyder's Cut last night, which is four hours long, but we really loved it. And the second I saw Cyborg come onto the screen, I was like, oh my god, how fun would that be to paint? It was actually quite difficult, so I've done like a more um, basic version of it. So keep on watching and I'll show you how I created this look. Um, and I also talk about what I thought of the movie, um, my favourite scenes and characters and stuff, so let's get right into it. I've already done this glam makeup earlier today, so I'm just going to work off that as the start point. I'm just using a picture I found on Google of a cyborg, um, just to like sketch out the shape of it, and just to use as like a reference photo. Um, so firstly, I'm just going to take a black and sketch out the shape that I want. I'm just going to use this little brush. shape um, and I think my next step will just be to paint this all silver so what I liked about the movie was that it gave more backstory to some of the characters which was really cool including Cyborg um, and I don't know, like some of the scenes, like the battle scenes were really cool. I feel like they were extended. I really enjoyed the Amazon's battle scenes. They're incredible, amazing woman. Very inspiring. But then I do feel like there could have been more women in the movie because I know there are other girls that are meant to be in the Justice League but hopefully they'll be joining in later on if they keep making more. Um, I know my partner really wanted more um, to the Superman scene when he came back to life, which they did kind of do. Um, and he really liked that he was wearing his black suit because that's what he was meant to be wearing. Apparently the reason, I don't know if everyone knows this, probably they do already but I just found out. Um, the reason that they made the Snyder Cut was because he was originally the director um, and then sadly his daughter Autumn committed suicide while they were still finishing the movie. So they let him do it again a while later which I thought was quite cool and he puts a little tribute to her at the end as well who's your favorite character from the movie I can't really well actually mine is Wonder Woman love her but they're all so cool, like Aquaman I think is really cool, Superman was obviously really boss, Batman, always love him. Cyborg was a cool new character that I hadn't really seen a lot of before. And the same as The Flash, he hasn't really been in many other movies that I've seen. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool. And yeah, like overall, I just loved it. It's worth four hours out of your life. Okay, 
So I'm just laying down the silver colour. Next, I'm just going to start sketching out the segments and then shading in that part. were trying to fight to keep the cube. I really love any scene that they're in to be honest but I just love seeing them in battle like they're so badass. just looking at a reference photo and from the comics so that might be a little bit easier to paint for me I'm sort of doing a combination of the two Monday sometimes. I get Sunday, Monday off work, so sometimes I just spend my Mondays painting. I actually just really love it. It's a great creative outlet for me. So what I'm just realizing looking at this re reference pack is that you don't actually want your lines to meet up that well because it, then you can give the illusion of different plates in the middle. They kind of stick out a bit. That's a good thing. So I'm just going to paint that little circle blue. So I just painted blue in here. And so for the eye, I'm going to take the black all the way down and then paint a red shape for the eye. Kind of like an angry shape of this brow. I'll see if I can replicate it. So one of the other great things about the movie um, was that it didn't get boring even though it was so long. There was always something important happening um, that's why if we had to go like to the bathroom or get a drink of water or something we always paused it because there was never really a dull moment um, and you're scared to miss anything so that was quite cool it was really action-packed a lot of great fight scenes which I quite enjoyed okay I'm trying to make this eye shape Literally painting my eyelashes red. So I've just drawn 
white lines all around the black lines to give it some dimension. Just gonna finish it off on this side over here. shadow effect. shiny eyeshadow to give some highlights as well. Yep, yeah, I've got this silver from the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Sultry palette. So this is how it turned out. It was quite a fun face paint. I did simplify it a bit. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me today. If you have seen the movie, please comment down below what you thought of it. Um, also comment what you would like to see from me next. And if you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And I'll try and upload more videos soon.